Flying. <laughs> well, would you mind flying with the rest of the formation? <laughs> Brad, if we can't finish a song together, there's no way we're gonna win the battle of the bands. Hey, relax. We're a cinch. Hey, we got a hot sound, good songs, and most important, me. <laughs> Look, I think we have an even bigger problem than Brad. Well, what do you mean? Well, the opening song just doesn't cut it. Well, what's wrong with it? Well, for one thing, it stinks. No, uh, you have a better suggestion? Yeah. I think we should open up with something that really grabs them. Makes them sit up and notice. Like Heart of Stone. You sing that song. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute, guys. That's not a bad idea. Look, why don't we vote on it? Yeah, all right, all right. All in favor of replacing a never-fail opener with a weak, untested, clumsy ballad that nobody understands. Okay, okay, forget it. I gotta get out of here. What? No, 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 Alfonso, we have more rehearsing to do. Well, I got a date with Kiki. Again, you know, you skipped out early yesterday to be with her. I know, and it was worth it. <laughs> Come on, Alfonso, what's more important, our group or a woman? Have a good time. Smells good, huh? What's for dinner? Prime rib. Ooey, ooey, ooey. <laughs> My favorite. Coconut icing. No, you don't. Okay. Yeah. I'll get my own. <laughs> no, Edward, don't! <laughs> that was oh. the horseradish for the prime rib. <sighs> You could have warned me. I wonder who that could be. I hope the fire department. Oh, Charles, hi. Please, come on in. Hello, Kate. Oh. Edward. Well, Charles, I hope Rick's band didn't disturb you next door. I told him to keep it down. Well, actually, I rather enjoyed the music. It frightened all the pigeons off my lawn. Well, then it's a friendly visit. Well, actually, I've come to ask a favor. Well, anything for a neighbor. I have to dash out of town on business. Problems in the weapons industry. Peace breakout. <laughs> How amusing. How about soda? Uh, no, thanks. Uh, we're having problems with the new missile factory in Houston, and I was wondering if you could look after my orchid plants. Sure, we ought to be able to handle your flowers. Your orchids. Prize-winning, priceless, irreplaceable orchids. <laughs> oh, those. We'll just put them in the greenhouse. Oh, I don't think Will and Maxie would like that. Who? A short for Wilsonara and Maxillare Orchidacea. Will and Maxie sounds good to me. <laughs> they don't like to be left alone. They're used to being with me in the house. Well, we'll keep them with us in the house. I don't want to impose. Oh, it really wouldn't be a problem. Oh, I'm so pleased to hear you say that. Now, all you have to do is miss them four times a day, nourish them with plant food and vitamin compounds, keep the temperature and humidity stable, and check the soil for the proper pH balance. 
Like Kate said, <clears throat> no problem. Then I'll bring them over. Oh, I'm sure they're going to like you. Oh. Bye. Bye bye. <laughs> Edward, how do you tell when a plant doesn't like you? Oh, it's very subtle. They promise to call, but they never do. You know, newborn babies require less equipment than this. <laughs> What's the lamp for? Well, just keep them warm during the cool evenings. Wow. Well, according to your notes, if they get colder than 58 degrees, it's... Bye-bye, buds. <laughs> Can you keep a secret? Why not? We're keeping everything else. <laughs> I think Will and Maxie will soon be cross-germinating. Cross-germinating? Well, getting it on. <laughs> Of course, conditions will have to be just right. Well, why don't you have Will ask Maxie out for a candlelight dinner? Always work for me. <laughs> oh, nice drive out to Inspiration Point. <laughs> Which has never worked for me. Well, it looks like your instructions are quite complete. Is there anything else that Edward needs to know? <laughs> yes, talk to them. Talk? Yes, plants love to be talked to. Oh, yeah? Any particular subject? Baseball? Movies? Uh, politics? Maybe they like to watch TV. <laughs> Leaf it to beaver. <laughs> Roots. Happy daisies. <laughs> La Fern and Shirley. <laughs> You are going to take this seriously. Yes, we are, Charles. Now, don't you worry. Your orchids are in good hands. Oh, thank you. Now, remember, you two, your guests here. So behave yourselves. Oh. <laughs> Cheerio. Bye-bye. Isn't it nice to see such devotion to a couple of plants? Yeah, we've lived next door to that guy for years. I never saw this side of him. Yeah, I didn't know he was a wacko either. come from? I'll give you a clue. It was Alfonso. <laughs> oh, hi. Hi, Mrs. Stanton. I'm Kiki, Alfonso's friend. Oh, nice to meet you. Well, do you think they're ready for a little snack? No, I think they're ready for a big snack. Yeah. I'll help you. All right. Here. So how long have you known Alfonso? A long time. It'll be two weeks tomorrow. <laughs> Hey, she shouldn't even be here. You know the rule. No chicks at rehearsal. Well, since when did we have that rule? Since she started showing up. <laughs> guys, guys, come on, look. Can we get back to the music? Hey, speak to Loverboy here. I wasn't the one showing off. Hey, I wasn't showing off. Alfonso. I was just doing my Michael Jackson. <laughs> Alfonso. Hey, you didn't see me doing my Bruce Springsteen. <laughs> You don't do a good Springsteen. Alfonso, I don't do a good Springsteen. <laughs> Snacks are ready. Food. <laughs> well, I'm glad I settled that. <laughs> I... Hey, I thought you were terrific. Yeah? When you're in front, the group sounds so much better. Really? You've got the best voice, the best moves, and you do a Michael Jackson better than Michael Jackson. Yeah? And like I told you before, if you want to win the Battle of the Bands, I think you should insist on opening with Heart of Stone. Yeah, well, uh, the guys didn't go for it. That's because they're jealous. They are? Yeah, because you sound so good. Hey, when you sing that song, it makes my heart throb. Yeah? Yeah. 
I have to run. Great. Now he's a one-man band. <laughs> Where's Kiki? She left. Good. Now you won't be jumping up and down during the ballads. Let's lay off, guys, all right? We have a lot of work to do. Like that opening number? Yeah, I've been giving that a lot of thought, and I uh, still think we should open up with Heart of Stone. I thought we already went through this. Yeah, I feel like I'm having a deja vu again. <laughs> Wait a minute, guys. I'm sure Alfonso has a good reason for bringing this up. Don't you? Yes, yeah, the kind of song that gives people heartthrob. <laughs> no, 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 no. It gives people heartburn. <laughs> See, Alfonso, we've already made our decision. I know why you guys don't want me to do Heart of Stone. You guys are jealous. <laughs> jealous? I think he's been standing too close to his amplifier. <laughs> it off. Alfonso, calm down. You're taking this too personally. Oh, sure. Take their side. What? Look, we either do the song or, or what? Or I walk. Guess I got your answer. Alfonso! Alfonso! missed you. <laughs> yes, I did, would poor kid you. <laughs> we we'll all get a little warmish to move this light off of you. Hello, hello, what's this? <gasps> a weed. weed. I'll have that, can we? No. There, you look much better. You look fantastic, if I do say so myself. Very sexy. <laughs> Dad. What? Does Kate know about this? No, just saying good morning. No, 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 Dad, you weren't. I saw the whole thing. You were hitting on an orchid. Ah, <laughs> uh, you guys gonna have band practice here again today? Yep. We'll be out. <laughs> but we'll be there Monday night for the... I, 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 the battle of the battle. <laughs> I think the battle is going to turn into a massacre. Oh? Yeah, we just can't seem to get it together. Without Alfonso, you mean? Alfonso has nothing to do with this. Okay, maybe a little. Okay, a lot. Well, you guys can always ask him back. Alfonso, we're just talking about... Rick, look who's here, Alfonso. Hey, Alfonso. I'm going upstairs. How you doing? Great. How you doing? Terrific. How's the band doing? Oh, fine. You know, of course, it's not the same without you in it. Yeah, well, uh, five guys make more noise. <laughs> Listen, Alfonso, if you ever want to come back... Thanks, Rick, but I can't. I just came by to pick up my mic stand. Okay, sure, it's out back. You doing some playing? Yeah, I joined the new group. Oh, who's in it? Kiki's brothers. They've been looking for a lead singer. Well, um, hey, congratulations. What kind of music is it? Top 40s, originals? Uh, originals. Kiki's been writing some songs. Kiki? And she's taking guitar lessons. <laughs> Great. I guess. Alfonso, this is stupid. We're best friends. Why are you in another band? Because I get the chance to do the songs that I do best. Alfonso, can I tell you something, friend to friend? What? You never started acting crazy until... Until what? Until you went cuckoo over Kiki. <laughs> hey, leave her out of this. This is all my idea. I like flying solo. Nobody telling me what to do. I'm my own man. Okay, okay. Well, hey, I gotta get going. 
Kiki gets mad if I'm gone too long. <laughs> okay, look, let's take the ending one more time, all right? And this time, let's step on the gas. Hey, Cubby, crank up the volume. I'm telling you, we're gonna kill. <laughs> oh no. Guys, I think we already have. Oh, I'm in big trouble. <laughs> Guys, this is a prize winning orchid. Not anymore. <laughs> so what? You didn't kill the plant. I know, but our music did. Guys, what am I gonna do? Hey, look, what's the big deal? Just go out and buy another flower. Brad, that's the dumbest idea I've ever heard. Dad, I'm sorry. It was all my fault, Dad. I killed Maxie. The music was playing too loud. That's why I bought this other plant. I thought I killed her by overwatering. <laughs> you know, she did look kind of soggy. It doesn't matter who killed her. Although, probably was the music. Well, lucky for us, I bought a spare, huh? <laughs> Rick, come on, it's immature and dishonest to try to pass off a stranger for Maxie. You're old enough no better than that. Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, no, you beat me to it. Kate? Well, when I saw what happened to Maxie, I knew you'd be devastated, so I went Went out. right out and bought another one. Yeah. See, Dad, see, great minds think alike. <laughs> I can't believe you two. Whatever happened to taking responsibility? When you make a mistake, you just own up to it. Now, Charles is on his way over now, and we're just going to have to tell him the truth. Quick, give me the phony plant. <laughs> Come in! Charles! Charles! Hello, Edward, Kate, Richard. Where are my babies? Right oh. where you left them. It's safe and sound, right, guys? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hello, Will. Hello, Maxie. Yeah. Maxie? What? What? Maxie looks a bit out of sorts. You, you, she didn't have time to put on her makeup yet. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. This isn't my Maxie. It isn't? No, it isn't. Kate, do you know anything about this? <laughs> I'm sorry, Charles. Here she is. May she rest in peace. Rest in... Oh, my. I'm really sorry, Charles. Maxie, you're pregnant. She is? Yes, that's how they get after they've been pollinated. They lose their bloom. Can't you see? There's a new growth down here. Oh. Red knight. Let's carry for them. Very good, guys. Very good. Okay. We have two more groups to hear before our selection committee picks the winner in the Battle of the Bands. Ladies and gentlemen, how about a big hand for the Fab Five? Oh, oh, the Fab Four. <laughs> Good luck. Hey, thanks, Alfonso. It's not too late. What are you wishing them luck for? They're my friends. I told you, you don't need friends like those anymore. One, two, three, four. <laughs>